Now, my song, I'd Love You to Want Me, was a little different story than most of the other things that I recorded back from that era. Uh, I had the idea of, of uh, Baby, I'd Love You to Want Me, and I had the melody to it. But I didn't have the story, and as, I, as it got more into the song, I, it, came, it became a thing about forbidden fruit. It, it, there was somebody that you couldn't have for whatever reason. And uh, after, I, after I finished the song and we started recording it, it became more obvious as it went along that we kept adding backgrounds and strings, and we went from New York to Atlanta to back, had Ellie Greenwich and Robert John singing the high part. Everybody thought it was a girl, but it was Robert John. And uh, as a matter of fact, Bobby was gracious to sing on, on all, almost all of my hits from those, those days. And the song just grew and grew and grew, and it grew into the biggest record I ever had, so it was worth it.